Hey folks, hope you're doing good today. Got to the end of the week already. We've had some great music on the show this week. I hope you've enjoyed it and found some bands that you're into and all of that stuff. As we finish off the week with some punk as we do always every week. Uh, but this week we've got some UK punk rock back on the show. The good stuff, the kind of shouty, angry stuff. Uh, this is a band called Woolly Boy. The track is called Stick It In The Water. So we're going to check this one out. bit of horns. energy in the music. Cool guitar tone. Yeah. Drops into the chorus nicely. It's got a good bassiness and low end. But the, the, the tone of the bass isn't kind of cutting through the guitars. But that's still got a nice bassiness to the music. Pace jump up bits in this track, mixing up the energies, mixing up the dynamics. guys just scraped through with a it's not a static image video uh, just about we'll accept that one but yeah that was worth it for the music because I enjoyed that very much uh, kind of good classic sound to it nice thick guitar tone in this though with a lot, quite a lot of distortion on those guitars good energy in the drums uh, really like the fast jump up parts uh, and a good vocal with lots of layering and stuff in there as well so yeah good job you hear the accent coming through this is a band called Perjury um, and they've got a track called Strip of Words we're going to check this one out next Sorry about the plane. Fucking plane. Oh, no, I've had to restart this one because a massive low flying plane just came over and totally ruined all the sound. So we're going to check out this one Perjury Punk Band. Uh, this track is called Strip of Words. So let's check it out. Hopefully, no more planes come over.
bunch of old school, isn't it, youngster in this band? Pretty cool. They look the part. They got the right sound. You can hear the bass nicely in this mix. Cool, love the accent coming through. It's got a cool tone. He's working his kit. Now, what's interesting about this mix, and this is one of the first times it's happened on the show, is we've got the guitars panned out to the left. And the bass panned out to the right, and that's why you can hear them both so nicely because they've both got their own place within the stereo. Kind of one's on the one side, one's on the other. It's an interesting way to do a mix. Usually you have two layers of guitar and pan them out and then run the bass straight down the middle. But yeah, it's kind of cool to have the bass in the one ear and your guitars in the other. He's got a cool guitar tone. Those marshals. Yeah, sounds good, sounds right, sounds authentic. I love the accent coming through. It's got a cool vocal. These guys have been round the block. This guy's working his kit nicely. He's using the cymbals right. Tinging away on the right. Yeah. Cool. As I say, I like the way they did this mix, and, and it's re I think it's really the first one we've had on the channel that's been mixed like that, because uh, it's, it's quite unorthodox, it's, you know, it's unusual, uh, but it's, it's still work for this piece of music, definitely. I'll, I'll have a think about that for my own music, maybe try it out sometimes in the mix myself, because uh, what I always do, and you know, you just kind of do it out of habit, that you just pan the guitars out left and right and run the bass straight down the middle and that's kind of you know you just do that without even thinking about it um, but yeah it's kind of cool to think outside the box and maybe say well we'll have the guitars in your left ear and the bass in the right ear and that means you can always hear exactly what they're doing uh, and it wasn't that they were panned out a hundred percent either way I think they're about 50 percent either way um, so it wasn't as if you know it was just the bass in this ear and just the guitar in that ear there was still a bit in the middle um but yeah panned over this way panned over that way and then the drums and the vocals straight down the middle it's just a different way to make up the mix comes across the ear in a different way so yeah pretty cool let's move on to this last band of the day this is pgp parks goes punk uh, the track is called uh can you do me a favor i think um this is a long one so we're going to check this one out see what it's all about let's get it on the screen Now this one's a different mix altogether as well. Cool 
Ooh, energy. Yeah, good energy in the music. Oh, we've got the, actually the opposite going on in this mix. I've got the bass in my left ear and the guitars in the right ear more so on this track. So we've just flipped the switch. The, but the drums are a bit more buried in the mix on this track and not quite as punchy as the last band. So it's got that darker sound to the mix, a bit more muffled. Again, it's not super stereoed. If we moved on to another track here. We'll keep going. It sounds good. Drums sound cool. Yeah, drumming. Because you got good energy. Yeah, drummer's killing it in this track. Double bass in, loads of drum rolls and stuff. Real high energy vocals. Cool. I think this must be an album. And we're just going through the tracks, so I'm going to stop it there because I think we've listened to a track or two there. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's an album. It's a five-track album. So I think we've listened to two tracks there, but very, very nice. I enjoyed that. These guys have got a different sound. We've had three different types of mixes today uh, and not and a kind of unorthodox and unusual mixes, um, not following all the usual set out, set in stone rules that people do in the mix. And I like that. I like that these guys have thought out the box in that way um, and that the, the music comes across the ear in kind of not a typical way, not a typical, you know, box standard mixing way where say you've just got the guitars band and the bass and the drums straight down the middle and all of that kind of stuff um so it comes across the year in a different way um and you know music's just sound at the end of the day that's the way i look at it it's it's sounds that make up a bigger sound um and and, and really the mix and the thing i like about mixing is that you can mess around with those sounds uh you can pan them out you can add effects you can stereoize them you can delay them and re reverb them and all these kind of things and that's uh, a way to affect the sound to make an even different sound um, and when you do things like that in the mix it comes across the ear in a different way um, and because our ears are so used to hearing you know music done in the standard way when it's a bit out of the ordinary makes your brain think a bit more it makes you know kind of it's unusual and you kind of sit up a minute and go hang on this is, i haven't heard something that quite sounds like this before so yeah that's what i like about it very much very cool hope you've enjoyed that today three different bands uk bands hear the accent coming through in the vocal as well which you know i love um some real good high energy punk today as well some good jump up stuff so yeah i hope you've enjoyed that. that's going to be the end of the week kick it off with 30 minutes again of grindcore tomorrow so if that's your jam tune in for that as well. See you guys. Bye.